Hey everyone, this is Ben, and thank you for joining us on this episode of the Semper Gumby channel. Here we are again, testing another 12.8, 100 amp hour lithium iron phosphate battery, or a LifePo 4, and this time it comes from a company called Go Kilowatt. That's spelled G-O-K-W-H, right here. And this battery's pretty awesome. I, first of all, I like the color scheme. Now that does, has nothing to do with the performance of the battery, but this yellow and black is amazing. And we'd like to thank Go Kilowatt for sending us this 12 volt battery because coupled with this inverter, we powered up pretty much our Starlink and our uh, electronics last night camping in our ProMaster van. But right off the bat, um, it's got a hard plastic shell. It's IP65 and it has what they, this thing is called the smart battery. If you look up here, there is a LCD screen, and we'll show you that here in a little bit, but it will give you and monitor the battery levels on that. Just like a lot of other lithium batteries, the popularity of them is because you can take this down almost like pretty much to zero, and the charging capacity uh, for these is just amazing. Now this has a prismatic cell. LifePool 4 is an automatic grade and it offers 1,200 watt hours of power. Now the cycle times, it's ultra durable and long lasting. You get 4,000 to 15,000 cycles. What does that mean? That's how many times you can charge and discharge this battery. 4,000 to 15,000 depending on where you take the percentage down to. That's, that's pretty amazing for a lithium iron phosphate battery. Now it has eight to 10 years a lifetime uh, on this battery. So it'll last eight to 10 years. I mean, there's no other lead acid battery that can compare to a lithium iron phosphate. One, another big feature is the weight of these things. It is amazing. They're just lightweight and it's 100% DOD, meaning high rate of discharge. Now, like I said, I had this in the ProMaster uh, when we went camping last night, and this thing ran my Starlink, my 12 volt refrigerator, and all my electronics uh, uh, with this inverter here. And it's a, it's a great alternative if you're dispersed camping and don't have a power station uh, go kilowatt battery has a built-in bms which is a protection system to protect your battery and other electronic equipments now this has charging protection thermal management battery cell balancing data transmission and battery aging and that is all built into this battery there are three ways you can charge this battery one is a 20 amp DC to DC charge generator, and it would take about five hours to charge this battery up. The secondly is the 12 volt uh, 20 amp battery charger, and that is sold separately, and it'll take five hours to charge. And then the third one is what I run, is a solar panel with an MPPT controller and they say it's about one day, one sunny day. Uh, that's up to, they recommend f up to 400 watt solar panel. So those are the three ways. So any, either way, uh, you'll be able to charge this battery uh, within about five hours. And we're gonna cover this smart battery LCD screen. I've never seen a battery that has a built-in LCD screen to give you uh, the battery status. Now, the voltage and remaining capacity display will have in, will be in bars, and I'll show you that in a little bit. I don't know if we uh, this light uh, will allow that, but um, it also has a low voltage alarm settings, and then you can customize your high and low voltage settings as well. And then uh, lastly, you can customize automatically turning off the backlight. But that is a really cool feature, especially if you want to know the status of your battery. 
Now this inverter here has an LCD screen uh, right up in here to tell me what the status of the battery is as well. So um, I can check the inverter or I can check the LCD screen on the battery itself. So let's go look at this little screen. So let's take a look at the Go Kilowatt battery, smart battery LCD screen. So to turn it on, go ahead and press it once and it'll cycle through. But right now I'm showing 80% battery capacity, 13.3 volts. I uh, currently have no amps being drawn off the battery, so 0, 0.0, and it's showing 5.6 degrees Celsius. Now, when you do have it hooked up, it'll go. To, you can go to the next screen, and it'll show you um, some other functions that you can do. But it's pretty cool. I like the screen; it's nice and visible. And then it'll shut off um, in about one minute. So that's the battery LCD screen. But overall, I was impressed of how this battery performed last night. It powered up everything that I needed and it, no flaws. Like I said, you know, coupled with a 2000 watt inverter, you should be able to uh, pretty much power on everything you can supply to it. Next week, we're gonna bring a microwave with us and we're gonna be doing some cooking uh, with the microwave with this battery. But anyway, um, my overall impressions of the battery, it's a really cool looking battery. It's very sturdy. It's got uh, a nice LCD display and that's what I really like about it. So until next time, no matter what life throws at you, always be Semper Gumby. This is Semper Gumby out.